Oh, hello, buddy. Hi. 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 <laughs> Good morning. This time it really was him. <laughs> it wasn't the... You all excited? A little bit <laughs> it wasn't excited. a figment of our imagination. Hi. Hi. Oh my goodness, he's so excited. Oh my gosh. He's so excited. <laughs> Hi, buddy. Hi. <laughs> oh my goodness. He's moving so fast. So, so incredibly oh fast. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh oh so excited. So excited. So excited. <laughs> oh my gosh. All the, all the hugs, all the love. Oh, no, no. Oh. You, gotta, you gotta love Ellie. Oh. Oh. Go get her. Hi. 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 He's very happy to see us this morning. You're get gonna that need, baby. You're gonna need a nap after this. <laughs> after mm. this excitement. Okay. Like, mm, maybe I can just go underneath this blanket. Oh, maybe you want to go under the blanket? Where's Pinto? Where'd you go? Oh, there he is. <laughs> Hi. Pinto. What you been doing this morning, Pinto? Hi, buddy. Barking Hi. at some squirrels. Hi. Are you barking at squirrels? Hey. Oh. Hi. Hey. Hey. So now that Pinto has. Oh been brought into the bread truck, now he comes in on his own and just comes to visit in the mornings. So we just hear his little click click clicking of his nails in the front, because mm -hmm. we usually have the front slide door open, so we just hear the little clinking of his nails. <laughs> calm, calm yourself. <laughs> so good morning, Ellie. Good morning. Say hi to YouTube. Hi, YouTube. I didn't even brush my teeth yet. They can't tell that. They <laughs> I can no tell. Idea. It's funny because it's like noon. <laughs> Is it? I don't know. It's got to be close to it, I think. I've been up since seven. Yeah, we've been up for a long time. Yeah, let's see what time it is. Oh, it's 11. 11. That's not so bad. It's been, it pizza? been busy. Chatting with babes online. All day. Thank you. <laughs> that is a crazy dog. Oh. We gave him a little bath yesterday. He rolled in some poo, so he's nice and clean now. Mm -hmm. He's sparkling clean. And I even took a bath yesterday, but yep. he's apparently thinks I'm not clean enough. Well, I took a bath too. We all took baths. Yeah. The whole, every everybody in the isolation ship, <laughs> everyone in the whole isolation ship took a bath yesterday. Yeah. I don't know if Maggie took a bath though. Oh, maybe that was maybe too not. before. Same diff. Same diff. I can't even tell what was yesterday and what was the day before. So I figured out something exciting today. We're on 12 days of full isolation. We're, we got two more days to reach the two week mark without being in contact with any other people or leaving this property or anything. So It's true and it wasn't even that hard for us. No, it wasn't that bad. I mean, we have a pretty ideal place. But even so, even if we just had the bread truck, this wouldn't have been that hard. Yeah, totally. I mean... We were just doing it in Slab City. Like, we weren't really leaving there. I think we left, like, maybe about every two weeks. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. I mean, it's nothing for me to be able to stick somewhere for a while and hang out. I'm not worried about it. But yeah. But I am excited to hit that two-week mark with no symptoms no sickness no worries of anything like that so mm -hmm. we are feeling healthy and doing very well and i just wanted to bring that up let everybody know where we're at in our I isolation yeah. our quarantine yeah we definitely realize that this is not the situation for most people that this is a lot harder for most people for many many reasons and we're feeling pretty privileged for sure. We're super blessed and super lucky to be here. Uh, not Most people don't have a location like this to exist in. So Yeah, really and great. also aren't used to 
this being their life this is already yeah. kind of our life so right, it hasn't been a difficult adjustment and we're not worried about paying our mortgages and taking care of kids and all of the things that a lot of people are dealing with yeah luckily we've set up our lives not to be in that situation I guess. yeah and so. i don't even think that we've ever said this on here but we actually were planning on being here anyway for two or three months mm -hmm. so it just happened to fall at the right moment when we were already planning to be here because my my best friend is about to have twin babies and Twins! about an hour away from here so we were planning on being here so that i could help support her through the end of her pregnancy and um when the babies come so that's not happening because everybody's in isolation well the babies are coming well but. yeah yeah they're, they're <laughs> that is happening yeah yeah you're right that's definitely happening. They're not in, in quarantine in utero. <laughs> no. Um, <laughs> but, but I'm not going to be going anytime soon to be there. They're they're definitely heavily isolated. Right. But anyway, it worked out because we were planning on being here and had already had it all set up and we got here and haven't left since. <laughs> yeah. And all the news is so good about the babies, how healthy she is and the babies being healthy. It's hard to take two twins to like full term because they're so big, you know, there's so much in there, but um, she's really doing wonderfully. Yeah. So her it's name's pretty Kellen. awesome. Yeah. And we love her. Mm hmm. I'm super proud of her. She's such a trooper. She is she's, such a trooper. She's just killing it out there. Mm hmm. <laughs> she's doing awesome. Yeah. She's doing the opposite of killing it. Yeah, she's she, she's she's growing it. She's growing it. <laughs> she's birthing it. <laughs> yeah, really proud of her. Yeah, and so excited to meet the babes. Yep. Totally. Yeah. I don't know why I was saying that. Just that we were already planning on. We being were here. planning on being here for the twins. Yep. But we won't be able to visit them as soon as we'd like. But that's okay. And They're gonna get a lot of nice alone time with the babies, That's with true. no visitors. So Which is it'll be a blessing, a blessing in disguise. Yeah, because yeah. they had a, have a lot of family and friends around. Yeah, definitely. Um, but we were so we were planning on being here for like till the end of May, but now at this point, we'll see. We'll see. Maybe we'll be here till the end of December. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Ah. Hopefully, long enough to see some of our plants growing in the garden. Pinto. What? Yeah, get what him. are you doing? Get him. <laughs> oh, Mr. We should Pinto. put like a little, oh, I guess there kind of is a dog toy on the camera, so he goes up and tries to mm -hmm. get it, but we don't really want him. I don't really want him to gnaw on the microphone. No. He's looking right at it right now. Yeah. What if I shake it around a little bit? What's that? What's get it. Look at it over here. Over here? Over here? He's like scared of it now. What is that? Little buddy. <laughs> he does this little stomp thing. He's such a little alien dog. <laughs> I mean, he's great and everything. He's just an alien. Are you supposed to give a shout out to someone? Yeah. Shout out to a guy named Phil. Philbert. Phil. Philbert. <laughs> Phil. What's up, Phil? Wish I met you in Quartzite. Sorry I missed you. Have a great summer in Mount Hood. Yep. You're in good hands. With Rockstar Rob. Rockstar Rob is the man. He, we <laughs> love Rob. Yes. You're lucky to be working with him. Yep. Rob's the best. Best ever. Such a good dude. Truth. Mr. Pinto. Oh. Good friend. <laughs> what? Oh, hi, buddy. All right. Well, we're going to go. This is our bechecken. Bechecken? <laughs> this is our bechecken for the day and uh we'll see you in the next video yeah maybe we'll go put pants on now maybe she's pantsless <laughs> <laughs> bye guys see bye. you tomorrow i just want to show you guys paul's outfit today <laughs> what's wrong with my outfit nothing you look great do i look high high your outfit looks like you were probably <laughs> high when you got dressed. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I can't really. Well, I, got high. <laughs> I can't really say much. My outfit's not much do, do, better. Do, do, do. Let me see the camera. <laughs> <laughs> Bam. Ta -da. <laughs> you look kind of like you're gonna have a tennis match. Yeah. Yeah. A little know. bit. I don't know if this is.
uh, yeah. YouTube approved. It is. There's no. <laughs> Just uh, at the moment. There's no cheek. If I take any steps, though, it might not be, <laughs> might not be <laughs> YouTube appropriate. I just have to walk like this. <laughs> Don't look at me. <laughs> <laughs> I was trying to keep the camera kind of high. <laughs> oh, it's so much high talk. <laughs> hey, what can I say? Hey, hey, what can I say? So anyways, my outfit. This is a, a thrift store find. Came from Savers, I think. It's but actually mine. Three like X. It's actually at least it's how he's dressed. It's was, a dress. I was getting to that, <laughs> but uh, yeah, it's a. Uh, you want to stand up and show off? No, not really. But <laughs> it's, it's quite large. A large man wore, once wore this shirt. Yeah. Oh my God! It's like hold on, let me get it straight. <laughs> it looks kind of like a blanket when you do that. Yeah. <laughs> Or like some futuristic fashion, like it would like Erica Badu would wear it or something. Yeah, like, it or would like just stay out on its own. Yeah, like <laughs> yeah, robotic. it would be like a I puffy. Push a button and... It's a puffy flannel. <laughs> <laughs> it's a mix yeah. between a puffy coat and a flannel. I rolled flannel. the sleeves up a while back, which was a dumb move because it's cold. I Should always have the sleeves have rolled up because they're so long on me. <laughs> this is big and tall. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, you definitely. Got the double plaid going on. I do. I do. These are pajama pants. Also from Savers. Also from Savers and my signature Ugg boots. It's falling my, apart Ugg boots. My basic Anyone bitches. have the Ugg boot hookup? Because <laughs> Paul and I need it. <laughs> we we both need Well, you have yours. You just need some I need. I need a cobbler. Thing. Anyone know a cobbler? Is that like a small elfin uh, type creature? Yes. <laughs> tiny hammers and yes <laughs> they go they actually go inside my boot to fix it yeah they mm -hmm. they could live in there they probably yeah. do that might be like the only person that could actually fix my boots okay thanks for showing us your outfit you're